17-year-old Joseph Smotherman is getting final instructions before taking his place on the firing range. Remember, keep this hand in tight. Fire with right hand. Three rounds. You'll scan and then host. Joseph is part of the 2011 Junior Deputy Academy. For the past eight years, the Lee County Sheriff's Department has offered the two-week class for teenagers and young adults interested in criminal justice. The class is free, but the selection process is tough. Cadets are selected because of their grade point average, uh, because of their uh, discipline in school. This is not a trouble teen program. This is kids that have excelled in school. It is a full two weeks for the cadets. They learn about virtually all aspects of law enforcement, from accident reconstruction, patrol, jail administration, dispatch, communications, records, and self-defense. Cadets say the training gives them an uncensored look at what it takes to be a law officer. But it's really interesting. I mean, it takes a lot of discipline to be in law enforcement. Uh, stuff don't have it as fast as it does on uh, TV, you know. Um, it. There's a lot to it. It takes a lot of dedication, that's for sure. <laughs> oh, I've learned so much. There's so many different departments in, in, in police work and in the sheriff's department. Uh, there's much more than I had ever thought. Um, and through these courses and through these classes, we've been able to learn about the different things that they do and all the many branches, even within those branches. On Friday, a graduation ceremony for cadets will take place here at the Lee County Justice Center. It's the culmination of 80 hours of training, hard work, and a rare chance to see and experience life behind the badge. In Tupelo, I'm Allie Martin, WCBI News.